This is like everything in life you have to earn. You have to earn the money to buy the food, but in order to eat the food, but you don't really deserve it yet. So therefore you have to just go and earn it, do the cardio, burn the calories, man, and there is no fucking magic pill. So when you first signed up in the gym, when I first signed up in the gym, I didn't know how to do anything. What kind of exercises are good, what should I do, and how should I start? The truth is, it's on you, bro. You need to find a way. You need to learn, and you need to study, and you need to practice this shit. It's really like that. It is just like everything else in your life. Imagine when you first get born, bro, you can't do anything. You have to learn how to walk, you have to learn how to talk, you have to learn how to speak, you have to learn how to write. Everything you want to do, you have to learn. It's the same thing in the gym. And the more you learn, the better you get. And the, your body is just a reflection of this. It's like there's players, there's tennis players, stage players, there's these table tennis players, you know? And it's the same with bodybuilding. Your body is only a reflection of how good your skill is, how good your knowledge is, and how good your dedication is. Bodybuilding is such a good spot because it's a direct reflection of the things you're doing. What you're doing today has an impact for tomorrow. There's no cheating, there's no easy way out. It's not like with football or soccer or stuff. There are other sports, you know? When you go, you have two sessions a week and you train. Look at everyone who is a successful sportsman. These people, they practice every day, they practice for hours. And it's the same thing in the gym. You just don't only go to lift some weights and do something. No, you go inside of there and you focus. You exactly know and you want to learn. When you go inside the gym and you try to learn about yourself, you study yourself, you study your body, because not everyone is the same. Hey, yo, yo, yo guys, what is up? Uh, so yeah, just woke up to some sad news that one of my favorite bodybuilders also passed away, Joe Lander. Um, as most of you guys might have known him, um, he was known for Braza. Uh, so yeah, he, he was really an, an energetic guy. He worked out extremely hard. So yeah, I just finished watching the, the video from Correct to Set explaining um, maybe what might have happened. So yeah, it's really sad to see one of the good people pass away because of maybe performance enhancing drugs so yeah um we would never know the full story but yeah i i just hope um everyone out there who loved him um will keep on working will keep on going and he really left a legacy behind rest in peace jolanda aka Braza. so without further ado let's get started with the video let's go guys what is up your boy sticks back here hope you guys have been good man hope you guys have been great welcome back to another video welcome back to the episode 8 of the intro in the series i believe yes guys it's been a few days but yeah your boy is back man um i've um i came back this week um after i was off the whole of last week because i was sick so yeah now uh, so yeah now i'm back um i started gymming again on tuesday uh, so yeah, but it feels great 
to be back uh so yeah guys you guys hope you guys are still doing good hope you guys are still doing great if you if you guys are really sit back relax and enjoy this video and while you edit give the video like subscribe channel, drop, drop a comment there say what's up leave a nice something you want to ask me something you want to tell me drop it down below and then we can interact but anyway without further ado let's get started with the video let's go Yes, guys. Um, it's been a, a quite a minute since I've since I've been on my laptop. I've just been chilling for the past few weeks. Like I said, I was sick and stuff. So yeah, I've not really been on my laptop. And there's a few things that I want to try and get done. Uh, so yeah, I'm just. It literally took me about ten minutes to switch it on, do all its updates. So yeah, I think. Yeah. So um. <clears throat> Hopefully one day I can buy me a MacBook Pro or even a, a Apple Tesla because these things are slow. I have an Asus um, which I actually got from the university. They gave out three, three laptops, 2021 I think. I can't remember but yeah, first thing is slow and stuff but yeah, soon I'll be able to to my own but yeah um right now i just want to film my my transformation video i want to finish it so yeah um, i still need to do that and then i need to finish up the video so i will have this week three videos two videos that, that i can drop because i've really been in inconsistent for this last two 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 weeks so yeah so yeah um i'm gonna check it out with you guys again yeah so yes guys we just finished here at the track and also at the gym uh today's uh, track session was was very hard very 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 hard and then the gym also now we did a push day me and cat um he joined me today for a nice push day so yeah it it, it was intense we pushed each other very 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 hard so yeah now i'm just in the car i'm a drive home now go and chill at home and then start with dinner soon so yeah i'll see you guys man let's go It's a big world. Equip yourself. Phoenix 7 Pro. Yeah, I'm a slave for you. 